is Dylan Drows. <laughs> and what are we doing today? Snake, snake Rivals Base Snakes. Snake Rivals Base Snakes. And how does one go about making a Snake Rivals Base Snake? Now, if you don't know, Snake Rivals is a game you can get in the App Store and Google Play where these snakes run around and, and as they get, as they eat more apples, they get bigger and bigger. And if you run into things, you, you turn into pellets, right? Mm -hmm. is, that, is that basically how it works? And you win. All and right. you have to be like a long distance All right, well let's uh... Hey, we see two papers. Okay, go ahead. First draw a line in the middle of your paper. All right. Then make up a snake. So the snakes can actually be lots of different things, right? They like whales. Like, they could be animals, plants, vehicles, rocks, anything you want. The right. So the snake can literally be anything that you want it to be as yeah, long as it ends up in snake type form, right? Mm -hmm. That's the fun part, making it snakes. Okay. So, if we just put it the start, I'm going to choose an animal that will all do. So we will do a fox. A fox. All right. Let's do a fox. We're all going to do a fox. Fox. And then you make like a, you make a base off of both. Fox Sobra. Fox Sobra. But there's so many different ones you Fox. Um, uh, Cobra. Okay. Then you draw your guy. The head and the tail. The, the tail can sometimes have back legs on it. Okay. What do you think of this fox? It looks more like a wolf to me. Mm -hmm. This is better than mine. I think I drew a wolf by accident. I do like a bear. I do a bear. Alright, well what's the next part? I do a bear. Then you draw a circle with the guy opening its mouth in the circle. Okay. So here are, next we do our snake egg. This, uh, so the egg can be like anything you want, right? Uh -huh, but it's better one to be like kind of related to the animal. I'm gonna make it like a fox tail type thing. Hmm. Okay, what's next? Okay, then we'll kind of draw the parts. So first of all, blank part, which is literally just a square. Mm-hmm. So, not for I a fox. I put fur on it? Uh-huh, but if you have stripes, you can put the stripes on it. These are the going to be the pieces that are going to make up your snake. You have eight of them. You have eight of them. So I'm going to draw mine in advance. So I know I have enough No, but you might do something like this, like put your leg on Well, I'm just going to draw... I'll still, I can still do that. I just want to have a spot for each one.
tell me about your fox conda. Mine has... Point out each piece. Mine has a plain one. Okay, we have to go over the guy. Mine is fox conda. He has a, a messed up head. I messed up on the head, so I didn't get much better. But Then here's him opening his mouth in a circle. And then here's his egg, which is like a fox tail on a plate with legs. And here it's like a plain one, legs, fur, a stick, a baby fox, an eagle, a big boa, and spiked armor. Alright, fox obra. And the egg is just like this eye that's... This is probably the worst fox head anyone's ever drawn in the history of foxes. Here's a furry plain square. This is a fox tail square. This is like a devil square, tree square, legs and fur square, broby from Yo Gabba Gabba with a bird square, and metal armor square and rocket square. Alright, I think we got I think we could do better this time. I think that was a pretty weak shard. I wish you are now I could decide your own spy challenge to this time do with a plant. Do with a plant? Oh man. That's a huge challenge for me. Do a fly trap. Alright, well easy. that's a easy that's too easy. We did fly traps last time. I'm gonna do I'm gonna do um cactus. Hey, I wanna do a cactus. Cactus. Can I do a cactus? Cactus onda, just for lack of creativity. On the, yeah, do a cactus. We'll do cactus. Talk. What? Cac T U S. Cacta. Cacta. Oh, good enough. Conda. No, it's. All right, so Cacta draw your your front piece and your back piece Is for your right? first. Yep. It's supposed to sound like conda. Got it. Okay. Cat Cacta. Um. Draw your front piece and your and your your very front piece and your very back piece is gonna be your first. It's also the tail on the head, is another one. The tail on the head, head, right. work out. But if this connects, how, how that, is that just going to break off? Now it slams into this and makes it bleed. 
Ugh, like water pours out because there's water inside of it. And then you actually die if you use this piece because it bleeds out the other half part. Which is a trick piece for your milk? It's a trick piece, okay. yeah. You like see. buy it and then you figure out you wasted your money. you get it, yep. You wasted your money on that one because it'll kill your entire dragon. Okay. Kill your entire cactus. Okay, one cactus is called cactus to represent Honda. He's like a gentle from cactus, and that, but he's scared when he opens his mouth. Don't trust him. And his egg is just a very fat cactus. Here it is just like little spikes and big spikes, then a flower, then legs, a bird poking out, like a, a little like, branch, a fly trap, well hanging on the back. I do like the roots. And then like a whole desert landscape? Mm -hmm. Alright. This is the cat swanda. And it's this stupid looking thing. <laughs> and then it's got this is this is a view. That's a, supposed to be a seed. Spike, worm, flower, root. We're gonna fly through these. There's my armadillo and it looks like a horn. Let's there we go. Dylan's armadillo. Spikes. And then um, camel hump with fur. And then this one's supposed to be on fire, although it's, I'm not sure what it looks like. And this is the hotly debated dragon wing square. Alright. Final snake. This so, is going to be a monster snake. This is a made up one? A made up monster it's snake. Kind of like a dragon or something you know about? It can be, yeah. Um, Alright, I will do a mythical creature. I will do a unicorn. I'll do... No, um, I'll do an elf. I'll do my own kind a of dragon. A human elf. I'll do my own kind of dragon. Like, I'll make up my own uh, A Middle Earth Lord of the Rings elf. I don't know what that means. But I'll make up my own dragon. Like, basically like a person with pointy ears that can do magic. And they're tiny? No, they're normal size. This will be an elf. Dragon. I want to do, um, I like my own dragon. I'm going to give him like a happy face. Ew, really, that's disgusting. Why is it disgusting? Don't, don't you give him like a Christmas hat? Uh, not, not a Santa helper elf, uh, a, a fantasy elf. They're warriors and magicians. Alright, now we're going to give them their elf body. <laughs> it's not even here that have your neck connecting. Or I'm going to get there. Why don't you concentrate on your own? Okay, I'm going to... There you go. What's the first thing every basic elf should have? The, just nothing. Nothing? I miss for nothing and then you do like legs or something. Why do you have rare shoes? You should have shoes on. So not make it disgusting. Alright, um... Put in like striped clothes? I don't know. Yeah, alright. Striped clothes. So we're going Santa Claus elf again? I don't know. That's just random, I guess. Then we're gonna put arms on them.
<laughs> it's not supposed to be a sand ant, it's an elf trap. Alright. Constrict the dragon. We got him started out. He's Constrict a. Constrict dragon. What color would you say this dragon was? Mm, a nice light brown. A nice light brown, okay. With green stripes. <clears throat> you just can't see it. Sometimes them. they color them thematically as to what type of uh, element they sort of control. What does that mean? Well, sometimes like a blue dragon will blue, breathe water and a red dragon will be fire. And this one's like a, a green dragon. Green dragon will shoot like plasma. No, the green dragon will shoot leaves. Okay. And the, and the brown dragon will shoot mud. Okay, cool. All right. So he will... Like and he, then he's the dragon... Roar! He's mouth open there. Oh, let's put him fire out there. There you go. All right, and then there's the uh, the egg is kind of like he's popped out through the egg. He's kind of making it happen there. We have basic is small spikes, and then we have the next one is bigger spikes, and he's walking around. Web. Dragon wings, dragon arms, big horns, and we have a baby dragon we shooting have a lot fire. Of fire. And then and we have strikes. the Snake Rivals Treasure Horde. And a Snake Rivals like, thing on the back. I don't know what it is. We I started out know. with an intention to oh, make a, a fantasy elf, but we sort of made it a lot more Christmas themed. So there's your basic elf. And there he is with his mouth open, not too scary. He's just got a big grin. He's just kind of happy to be either. Then I tried to draw like a crystal ball. I tried initially to draw like a cut diamond and then I decided that I couldn't finish it so I decided this would be like a stand for a crystal ball but it ended up just being an ice cream cone. <laughs> and then um, with, uh, we got the striped component which made it started on its path towards Christmas. Then of course there's your Disney style magic wand. Then there's the one ring with an attempt to move back into Fantasy Elf. But we did a 180 there and made the Christmas present. Yeah, sure. This is the one Dylan didn't approve of. This is a, a giant ear. And now we have the foot with the Christmas Elf shoe. And then we have the Christmas striped shirt, but it's got a hand with a sword in it. And then here's one with Christmas lights and a reindeer on it. A metal reindeer. A metal reindeer. All right. Well, you know, how do you, how would you rate our snake rivals snakes? Is this some of your best work, or would you say some of your worst work? This is some of your worst work. <laughs> oh yeah. And the fox is your worst work. Actually. All right, guys. The fox is horrible. The fox, I don't think, was successful for either of us. Um. <laughs> snake rival challenge. You draw the front and the back, then a circle with the animal with its mouth, or the creature with its mouth open, then an egg. Then a name. Then you draw eight components and put your name on the top. That. So, smash that like button, hit subscribe, follow us on Instagram, follow dot Dylan Draws, and I hope you don't post your, your own challenge to Dylan Draws. Bye.